the day, and I have a special guest here today, one of my BFFs, this is Heather Freeze, and my neighbor, and my sister wife, <laughs> we have made a lot of meals together with our husbands, so we um, are baking, continuing our pumpkin lunch tradition here, and let me get the tech going here, and we are going to get started, we are making stuffed um, pumpkin pasta shells, jumbo shells with vodka pumpkin sauce, and we are also going to make a delicious sangria, white sangria with pumpkin spice and ginger brew, and we taste tested this the other night, and it is delicious. So let me get our tech going here, um, and we will get started on our, on our show here. So let me get us up here so Head can see our comments, and we will get going here. Uh, Head's gonna get started here with the. Hold on. Isn't this, this exciting? Isn't this fun? Yeah. Hey, you have some special guests watching today, Head? Yeah, I want to give a shout out to my beautiful nieces in Laguna, Kira, Giselle, and and uh, Sienna, here. and my babies in New uh, Goleta. Hi, Scarlett. Hi, Chloe. Hi, girls. <laughs> oh, you don't forget Luca. And little Luca. Luca's Baby Luca. happy. That's right. Okay, happy. so we're gonna get started here. We have got the we have a pound of chicken, spicy chicken sausage, Italian, in the pan that we just browned up while we were waiting for, for you. So to that, Hez gonna add one chopped red pepper that we have chopped here. Right here. So she's, she's gonna throw that in there and let it start sauteing. And into that, we are also gonna put about a cup of pumpkin into there for our pumpkin vodka sauce. So I will give her some pumpkin in here. Yum! I know. And I think this is a little more, I'm sorry, more than a cup, but I am um, just a whole cannon. Organic pumpkin from Trader Joe's. If you're having a hard time finding pumpkin, Trader Joe's came through. Don't panic, it's organic. Don't panic, it's organic! <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> okay, so we've got that sauteing in there, and to that, we are going to add our vodka. We have Ooh. half a cup of the good stuff. We got the big Costco Stoli that we are putting in our vodka oh, sauce. Okay. So let's let our vodka get fired up there. And then I just also pre-cooked while we're waiting for you these um, jumbo shells. These are the most jumbo shells I could find. I couldn't find any extra jumbos, but um, I got what I had there. Hey, Adriana, how are you? Good to see you, thanks for being on. So we are making pumpkin stuffed shells with sausage, vodka, pumpkin sauce. So let's get started with our filling then. So in our filling for our shells, we are going to do this container here of ricotta cheese. And we're gonna get this going here. Hey Erin, I popped my collar for you. <laughs> she always teases me about that. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so what kind of shells, have you made uh, stuffed shells before? Uh, yes, I make a recipe um, taco taco meat stuffed shells is delicious. Ooh, yeah, I'll have to do that one day. For With like a salsa, like an enchilada sauce. What kind of sauce? Yeah, salsa and cheese and the ground beef with the taco seasoning. Yeah, it's delicious. One of, my, one of my faves. Oh yeah, yeah. You never made that one for me. I know. <laughs> we'll have to make that one. Yes. Okay, so in here we're putting our container here of ricotta cheese. Yum. I think I bought the whole milk. <laughs> The director is is giving us direction. We got an awesome director. <laughs> the lighting, okay. everything. So throw in there the fontina. Now fontina we have is a delicious melting two cheese. cups of fontina. Mm -hmm. And to that we're gonna so add delicious. half a cup of pesto that I will get going here. I, you could make your own, of course. And make our own is fine too, but mm -hmm. today we are using That's not good when I talk about it. Yeah? yeah. Oops, sorry. Get the spoon in there. Whoa. How much? Half a cup. Oh, half a cup. So I'm measuring very carefully. <laughs> About a half a cup. Okay. Okay. Oh my gosh. Too much smells pesto. delicious. Oh, wow. I can't wait to try it. Okay. Yum. So I'm gonna get that out of our way here. Yum. You guys like pesto? Yummy. Huh? I do. Yeah. I know. It smells delicious. Oh my goodness. Okay, so how's our sauce go, going back here? Lisa's the hostess with the mostest. <laughs> always in, everybody's welcome, and she just oh. always throws a great party and is the best cook. Aw, thanks, Ted. Uh, I'm going to put the milk in our sauce. 
in here, in the sauce, yeah. There you go. And then we're going to put some spices in there. So let's get our, let me get up this stuff out of the way here. Organic, it's all organic, even the milk. Yep, yep, all organic. And so to that, I'm going to add two teaspoons of oregano. So let me get the lid off here and get two teaspoons of oregano going in our sauce. Mmm, that yes, sounds good. I know, yummy. Italian? Okay, Fontina. so when I use dried herbs like this, um, I always crush them in my hand. I'm going to get two teaspoons in, in my hand here. And then I'm going to crush it. Because it just brings out the flavor of the dried herbs. Yeah, that's true. So there's our two teaspoons of oregano going in. I'm going to put some... Uh, this has a pinch of red pepper flakes. I might use a hair more than a pinch. This is really a fall looking dish. Isn't it pretty? Orange, so beautiful uh, colors, reds and oranges. A pinch, I'll put a pinch in there. Yeah. <laughs> and our red pepper spicy. flakes, yep. And I'm gonna put some salt and pepper into our vodka sauce here. So, oh my gosh, it looks pretty. A little bit of salt mm -hmm. and some pepper. Oh my gosh, that does look very fall. Very Appropriate for the season. Yes. Well, this one just looks fun, kind of like pumpkin vodka sauce. Let's make that. <laughs> pepper in there. I'm... Oh, that looks good. Good. Yeah. Okay. All right. Just simmer oh, forgot my, for I forgot long. my pumpkin decor for pumpkin month. We're in pumpkin month. Forgot my little pumpkins. Okay. So let's get started. I'm gonna grab a. We're gonna stuff them, right? Yeah. So let me grab a. We're going to combine all this to get more We are going to make two of these. So right now we're going to start with one of these. I'm going to make these in a foil pan so I can easily give them away or I can freeze it because with a family of only three, we are not going to eat a whole casserole. But the recipe calls to make this um, in you know, a casserole pan, but we're going to make it in this. So we're going to put some sauce here in the bottom. Okay. Our lovely sauce. Let me get you a bigger. bigger. No, bigger. Wrong side. Yep, something bigger. Mm. Okay. Will work. Just put okay. this on the bottom. Yeah. Let me taste it real quick and make sure we don't need to add anything before Salt. we before we put that. How is it? Mmm. Good. Yeah. Always. Yes. So put this on the bottom. Yep. Put some on the top. Okay. Give me some. Burn yourself. A little more in there. Oh my gosh, it is good. Mm -hmm. Yummy pumpkin. Never had pumpkin. a bad meal, Lisa's. Yeah. Yummy! Mm -hmm. Who else wants to come over for dinner? Okay, give me one more scoop of that. Okay. Some. Okay, yep. Okay, the recipe called for half a pound of sausage, but of course I used a whole pound. Because um, we like we like meat around here. Okay, so Heather and I are going to give this a whirl here. So we're going to... They're finally now, cooled down a little bit, yeah. I cooked these um, al dente. And uh, these are the shells, and we cooked them just for a couple minutes before you guys got here. And we're going to take our stuffing here, that's our cheese and pesto and, and ricotta, and get them in there. That Yeah. That's good. Yep. And we're going yeah. okay. to fill these, and then put them on top of our, oh, whoops, one, down. one got away. Slippery little su uh, <laughs> sucker. <laughs> we watched Pretty Women last night. Remember that part scene when the S cargo went flying? Went flying. That was funny. I know. <laughs> Love that mo that movie. But it was on last night. We were so we got it. caught up. Of course, Heather knows every single word, every line. Watch a movie with her. She's got it all. Especially so. Arthur, my favorite movie of all time. Oh yeah. Hey girls, are you on? Heather, nieces, are you guys there? You can make comments, you guys, if you have any suggestions. Comment so we know you're there. You there, Scarlett? <laughs> It's a beautiful day here. I was just gonna say that. Beach, yeah, just beautiful. I was just gonna say that. It's perfect outside. That's some of our best meals that we've made. Oh my gosh, we've made so. What many was that? Meals. Fried bologna sandwich. Oh, oh my gosh, favorite. her favorite oh, thing on the no. show when I made the fried bologna and pimento cheese the sandwiches slums. in the in the oh. summer. I oh ate the whole gosh. thing and then I said I'll have another one. She ate two. She couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe it. We couldn't believe it. <laughs> but I'm like, no problem. We got it all. When out I like here. something, I like it. We had our. Oklahoma tube steak and pimento cheese, baby. Oh, what was that? Um, a biscuits and gravy casserole or something? Oh, I made the biscuits and gravy lasagna. It didn't sound good, but it was delicious. Oh, that was a crowd pleaser. We had that on Mother's Day. That was delicious. Mother's Day or Easter? I think it was Mother's Day. You can it was like delicious. It. He's picky. Yeah, he loved it. Hey, Chris, are you watching? How's Carol? Is oh, Carol there? Hi, Carol. 
How are you out? No, hi. Carol, are you there watching? Best mother-in-law ever. Yes, love Carol. Oh my gosh, Carol, I have a birthday present for you this year. I was just in D.C. and I bought something special for your birthday. Maybe the we big one. Her, maybe we should give her one of these. The big one. The big birthday. Coming, huh? Uh-huh. We're excited awesome. for it. Yes. Just Hey, her. Susan, how are you? Oh, there she is. Hey, Carol. Oh, hi, oh, Mama. Thank you. Oh, hi, Mama. We love you. Yes. Back. Oh, my gosh. This looks good, huh? Okay, so we have a pan of these all set here. Oh, my gosh. They smell delish. Totally delish. Mm. Anything with shells and pasta and oh, yeah, and stick stick one right here. Okay, so that pan. Is that enough for that one. Yep. Okay. So then we're gonna. She's gonna dri drizzle Drizzles some sauce. Little. You have to put a some more sauce. sauce on top, and then we're gonna put a little bit of chopped mozzarella on top of that. Just chunks instead of. We decided not to grate it, and we're gonna do chunks. And then I'm gonna move this for our next thing we're gonna make here for our sangria. And Head's gonna cut up that apple for me. Yes. I know, we should probably bring Carol. The next one. Yeah, save some, I'm gonna make another one. Okay. We're gonna make another pan. Oh my gosh, look at how beautiful this is. With our pumpkin sauce. Oh, really yummy. Yummy. And she's gonna put some um, mozzarella on top Little of that. Strips. She was cut in chunks so that when we cook it, it'll, be um, it'll cook about a half hour in the oven and then it'll get all gooey and yummy. Ah, yum. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Can't wait to try it. Oh, they were good. Susan, too. I was recipe testing this morning and made some cornmeal pancakes on a recipe I found. They're lacy. They look delicious and they were good and gluten free. And Heather, I called Heather. I said, Come over. I've got too much pancake batter. Come taste, right my, over, as usual. come taste my pancakes. Skip marks in the driveway. <laughs> but she lives right down the street. She, be she benefits. Okay, so this smells absolutely delicious, you guys. Look at that pumpkin, vodka. Spicy chicken sausage stuffed shells. Yummy. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we'll to go with that, we need something to cool us off. So I'm going to make this. Erin sent me this recipe. Erin Seiler, are you watching? Are you there, girl? Um, and I recipe tested this with my girls oh, the other funny. day. Um, look at my pumpkin. There we go. I've never used one of these. It works. My dear friend, Susan, had a pumpkin. We, we made these. That's Can so you believe cute. that? Me, so crafty. Cute. I'm not. And we, Erin, God bless her, carved this pumpkin out. My pumpkins are going off my head. Um, carved this out, cleaned my pumpkin out. It's a real pumpkin. And then we planted these succulents inside them. How cool is that? It was so fun. Plus, just fun to see everyone. And now I have a beautiful centerpiece. My pumpkins are getting away. Hold on. Okay. Now, sangria. White pumpkin spice sangria. This is delicious because, of course, we tested this out. I'm putting a bottle of Chardonnay. Sounds good. I know. Starting with a bottle of Chardonnay and use something you would drink. This is a Trader Joe's recipe and they were like, oh, just use two buck chuck. I just can't do it. I got to so. use something I can drink. We only drink when we're alone or with someone, right? What? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to use the um, Trader Joe's spice cider and we're going to do a cup of this. Which I, didn't, I don't have a measuring cup. I'm going to use my wine glass. So we're going to use about a cup of this. Very fallish too. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. So a cup of that, and then we're gonna mm. you chop that into smaller I'll chunks here. Okay. Yep. Um, I'm gonna. This is the pumpkin spice ginger brew from Trader Joe's, and hopefully it won't explode like it did the other Lisa day. Lisa has the best knives. I'm what so jealous. I was testing. My wedding gift to myself was oh. a whole set of really. You can't beat nice a good set knives. of knives. Invest, I highly recommend investing in. Good Even night. going over budget on a good set of knives because you have them the rest of your life and just makes cooking so much more the best. fun. And I actually bought those at Aspen Food and Wine. I was at Aspen Food and Wine that I'm year. I'm envious of and these knives. And it was knives. such an amazing event. If any of you have been to the Aspen Food and Wine uh, uh, event, it was spectacular. Okay, so there's our... Our Chardonnay and our um, ginger brew, and yeah, you know, throw the apple in. She's gonna put a chopped apple in. I'm gonna put three cinnamon sticks in. Hey, hold on, who wants me to move these? Okay, move those. Um, three cinnamon sticks going in, and I just got these two at Trader Joe's since it's a Trader Joe's recipe. And they're organic, organic. That's the only way we roll. Organic, and that is our. Chardonnay. 
uh, Chardonnay, white, our Chardonnay, Chardonnay, our white spiced Chardonnay. Chardonnay. I got everything in that. That's it, right? Yeah, that's it. And it is delicious. So now you let this sit in the refrigerator for three hours or up to overnight, and then um, you get to let have the a apples taste. Soak up all the flavor. Yeah, but we're gonna have a taste. Ooh. Just because we can. Just can't. because, right? Just because. So I have a little taste of my apple. I'm not gonna fall out of this one. Oh, oh whoops! Oh. <laughs> Okay. All right. Shout outs? Yeah, we're gonna do our birthday shout-outs here in a second. First, we're gonna cheers. Cheers. Yes. Oh. Mmm. That's really good. Not good. Yeah. Delicious. You guys will love it. Yummy Give and it refreshing. Try. Delicious. Okay, so we do have birthday shout-outs. So let me get change change hats here. You want me to say that? Anyone? Anyone? Yep. We have. Um, here's I have my list here. So we have for tomorrow. Do do do. We have Sarah Sato. It's your birthday. How are you, girl? Happy birthday. I haven't seen your new edition. I want to see your new edition. And then Adele Grenier. Hey, girl. It's your birthday. I am sure you are doing something along these lines for your for your birthday. I hope you are. Happy birthday to, to, to you. And then Jordan Eller. I don't know if you're on your boat somewhere halfway around the world. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday to you. And then Monday, we have Lisa McGrath. Happy birthday, girl, to you. And then we have... Jasmine Morat. Ja Happy birthday to you, Jasmine. She has the cutest little girl. Oh, she, she is, is a mama of a toddler now. So yes. happy birthday happy to birthday. you. Happy birthday. And Kimberly Robinson, happy birthday to you. So a lot of October birthdays. So you know if you have commented or liked on these videos here on Facebook or on YouTube, Ventura Real Estate, then you are in my drawing. In today's drawing, I got these really cute things for Pumpkin Month, for our October Pumpkin Month, these darling pumpkins. Now it could be um, your bag for your candy for your kids to go trick-or-treating. Um, I was at Costco the other day. We have full-size candy bars here because the kids have it bad enough. Lisa is so generous. With all this Zoom, we have real candy bars here this year. Of course, till they run out. But look how cute this is. Because I'm like, it could be a little purse. It could be a centerpiece. And look, it has a drawstring. That is cute, Lisa. It's your favorite are, color. That's your signature cute. color. Yes, I know. They were so cute. What is this color? So we um, are giving away two of these today. So let's see who our lucky pumpkin winners are today. Mm. Hey Mo, how are you? How's it going? I have I'm using my spoon Mo. If you uh, need a special custom Christmas gift, woo, you can get your one of these from Wood Designs by Mo. Kiss the cook, GaryandLisa.com. I love it. Yeah. We just used it for our pumpkin stuffed shells. Hey Jill, I can't quite see. Can you turn this a little bit? Because this the oh, glare the water. is on the I can't see it. Can you see now? Okay, here we go. Who so is lucky feeling winner. lucky today? So stick your hand in the fish and let's see who's winning it today. I won one time. I was doo, so doo, doo, doo. Kristen Silverman, it's your birthday yes. winner. She's a rock star realtor in Vegas. If you need the best realtor Yay. in Vegas, she is your girl. Plus so that means we gotta go to Vegas. We gotta right? go to Vegas. Yep, gotta go. We're Anybody coming to see you, Kristen. <laughs> uh, oh my God! Oh, she <laughs> pulled her own name out. I picked my She's son. So that's awesome because these are so cute. So thank you guys for watching. Love it. Here's another um, fun two pumpkin things we made here today. Um, and thank you all for watching. We are here Wednesdays and Saturdays live at 3. You can visit us at GaryandLisa.com because we do do real estate. If that's right. I, they sold me my house. We love it. It was the greatest, greatest experience. Smooth, flawless, and lots of fun. And I gained two awesome new friends. So Isn't that nice? Isn't that nice? Unprompted testimonial. Awesome. Um, it's a great your uh, real estate house. edge. Your real estate edge. <laughs> GaryandLisa.com. Your real estate That's edge. Right. She's got it down. She's heard it enough. Yeah. Um, so you visit us on our YouTube channel, Adventure Real That's Estate, amazing, Gary. And uh, <laughs> we love that you're watching live. We love you're here. And if you're watching the replay, hashtag re uh, replay. And we appreciate you being there. Remember, there's only two things you can control: your effort and your attitude. So always pick a good one and always do your best. And we'll see you here live Wednesdays and Saturdays. And thank you, thank you, Hev, oh, for being my pleasure. special guest. It was fun. And uh, we will see you again soon. Love you. Adios. Happy pumpkin.